Hello, 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 Scorpios. It's Jackson Knowledge Goddess. Welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm going to be doing your spiritual progress report, which is about, you know, where you're at with your mind, body, and soul. Um, please keep in mind that these are general messages, so everything may or may not apply to you in your situation, and that is okay. Please like, subscribe, and share with a friend who may need it. Also, comment below and let me know if it resonated with you. And if you would like to see more from me, hit that um, post notification bell next to the subscription button, and I would love for you to join. All right, so what's going on with Scorpios? I feel like y'all are at a state of being more formal or more cordial. Um, more patient. Very much so more patient. Learning more about yourself and who you are and what you want in life. All right, so for the mind, you have taking action. For the body, you have blossoming abundance. And for your soul, you have adjacent possibilities. Okay. Beautiful energy. Beautiful energy. So your mind is on taking action. Um, I feel like y'all are definitely learning to combine the, the light and um, dark aspects of yourself. You're learning to... Um, like I said, you, you learn to be more patient, taming your temperament. Yeah, um, you're at a state of um, gaining more respect, respecting yourself a lot more. I feel like y'all are going more of the traditional way of doing things. Okay. I feel like y'all have some ideas. Okay. Mm -hmm. Some type of decision you're thinking about making. Yeah. So there may be some things about the past that may have kind of like came up. And I don't mean past... I mean, you know, it depends on you and your situation. Like I said, like I always say, everything is not about love, okay? But if that is your situation, then that is your situation. But I see that what's on your mind is gaining more respect um, for the things that you have brought to the table. Um, I see you reaching a point of... Um, Like reaching a conclusion or you've done enough in a certain situation um, and you're recognizing that. Okay, what's this? Perfect. I see you learning to look at yourself in a better light. And um, <clears throat> the reason why is because you've done a lot of soul searching. What's this? Perfect. I see that you definitely been getting more in tune with your spirituality okay um i see there may be someone on your mind because i have the empress here twice what's the judgment some of you could even um like have a, a baby on the way or something like that or you have a new creative project that you're thinking about okay I see that you're looking at this. So this is a good goal. Like you're, you have accomplished a good goal or something like that. Um, you've achieved something. You've done a lot of work in, in something. Um, and you're, you're being a lot more happy. I see you. You're really learning the art of patience. I feel like it took you a long while to get to that point. I feel like now you've had time to really sit and, um, you know, converse with your divine team. And because of that, <clears throat> things are being illuminated to you and for you in order to move forward. And now you're starting to listen to the guidance that is given 
instead of controlling your thoughts. I feel like you have a lot of ways of controlling your thoughts a lot or being too logical and mistaking that for your intuition. Um, but now you're learning how to balance that out. Mm -hmm. Also, like I said, there's something, um, I feel like you may be thinking about something too hard, Put put more heart into it. Okay. So for the body, you have blossoming abundance. Nice. Um, so I'm seeing, you know, you have everything that you need. You have everything that you want. Um, definitely expanding your horizons. I feel like you used to be stuck. Here's your energy. You have the death energy. A big transformation in your life. Some of you may even be thinking about moving or renovating your house or something like that. Um, but I see that you've mastered something. And it's time for you to move into the next phase. And it could be uncomfortable at first. But you already know what you're going to be getting with going into it. It's just the process for you. Yeah. Um, so be careful of the, the lack mindset. Because those negative thoughts. Yeah. Those negative thoughts is not good for you at all. Either way. Um, the divine wants you to know that you're going to always have what you need. I always look at the positives okay i feel like you may have um you may feel like you don't know enough or you don't have enough information or something like that yeah you went through the journey of because you go from the four of swords <clears throat> to the ten of swords so You've been through the trying to escape a certain thought pattern or a situation. You've tried to avoid it. You've tried to escape it. Um, you try to um, look at the bigger picture. You try to leave it in the past. Then you went through, um, you know, it's like you went down a whole rabbit hole. And now it's time for you to see the light again. What's this death card? Some of you may need a change of scenery as well. And um, if you are um, lacking, you're going to be healing from that. Uh, things are going to be moving forward as they should. And if you do get to a point where there is a lack thereof in some uh, form or shape in your life, whether it's money, whether it's health, um, all of that, continue to move forward. Even if you don't know everything that you need to know. Yeah, you got the death card here. So there's a need for you to get out of that lack mindset um, cause you have everything that you need. You know, everything that you need to know and also know that you don't have to know everything. You don't have to know everything. Let the divine guide you. And if you start being up late at night or feeling like you can't sleep, what's, what's the, uh, advice for that for those who cannot sleep yeah know that you've done enough I feel like you feel like you haven't done enough you have done enough it is enough there is time enough is enough it's time for you to let something go or let a certain thought pattern go I see you also um getting clear about some type of job or something like that because it may be taking a toll on you 
You may have bitten off more than you can chew with something. Um, I feel like all of this is like you you self-sacrifice where you didn't have to or you didn't need to. Or maybe this was even a lesson for you to do that. But I feel like that's over with. I feel like one thing led to another. And you were, you thought that you were able to handle it, but there's a need for you to recognize that um, you couldn't, and that's okay. Don't feel like you're a failure. I feel like you may feel like you're a failure or you may have a lot of regrets so you feel like you lost too much because you've invested in something or... Um, something like that don't feel like a failure there's always a lesson to be learned never look at failures as a failure there's a lesson in that what is that lesson for you and did you learn the lesson so that you can move forward and not have to deal with this again yeah D did you learn the lesson that you needed to learn get clear on that Okay, it's kind of like you were in training for something. You were in training. Okay, because these lessons were needed for you. Whatever those lessons are for you, just think about what did you learn from this whatever situation that you were lacking in. Whether it's job, whether it's love, whether it's family whatever also some of you may be getting some type of money from a death in the family or something like that my condolences if that's the your case um all right okay so for the soul you have adjacent possibilities like i said i really do believe that some of you are um thinking about moving be careful not to fall into a trap, okay? Um, check all of the facts. Check all of the facts. Don't move too fast. Don't just see something. You're like, oh, it's beautiful. Okay, that's, that's mine. I want it. Like, no. Check all the facts before you move forward, okay? I know that sounds kind of contradicting from what I said earlier, but, you know, if this has to do with business, then, yeah, check the facts, okay? Especially when it has something to do with the home. Um, otherwise, spiritually, I feel like um, some of you could even be too spiritual. Uh, I know that sounds bad, but, you know... When you're dealing with spirituality, you have to ground yourself. Meaning, when you're too much into spirituality and not in tune with reality, that's an imbalance. So, there's a balance to everything, okay? Like I said earlier, enough is enough. Okay? Yeah, because you can get too confused. Um, I feel like also you you may even be at a state where you convince yourself so much to the point where it's an, it's an imbalance. Like you're not recognizing something. There is too much of something. Whatever that is in your life, whether it's smoking, whether it's drinking, whether it's thinking about somebody too much, whether it's too, um, you know, being inside too much or uh, being too controlling. Um, whatever this too much is that you know that you needed to let go of. Let go of that and things will start to, to flow a lot more easier. This is not a staff. 
Um, okay. Okay, so I feel like you're recognizing it. Um, I feel like you also think too much about the past. Get over it. Okay. What's the seven of cups? I feel like you, with you avoiding thoughts and situations and not tackling it head on. Um, and it's like, you know, you're trying not to think about these certain things. You're just trying to avoid these thoughts. I feel like you need to take these thoughts head on or take on this these fears head on, okay? Don't try to hide from it or avoid it. You really need to process these thoughts before moving forward. Um, let's see, what's this magician card? What's this magician card for Scorpios? Okay, so you got the lovers. Um, there, there was something, there is something that you're avoiding. So some of you may even be avoiding leaving someone behind. Um, or you know that it's some things that you needed to do or needed to say. Go ahead and do those so that you can be free. I feel like you're you're trapped in some type of cycle um, that needs to stop. And with you being a very intuitive uh, sign, you know what it is. But like I said, you're avoiding it. Stop avoiding it, and things will be so excuse me so much more easier. Um, don't try to manipulate or control the situation how you want to. If it's not supposed to work out, then it's not supposed to work out. No matter what it is or who it is. What's this right here? And there's no regrets. Like I said, there's only lessons. Yeah, there's nothing to be confused about. I feel like you're you're making things harder than what it is. Or you're not seeing a situation for what it is. And that's what's stopping your growth um, or your progress. Okay. So let me pull a few more of these other cards. Okay. Some of you may think too much or you have your head in the clouds too much. It's time for you to get grounded, baby. Okay. So let's see. See? Exactly. Look, what I just say. You have the thinking woman, yin and yang, which is about duality. Okay? And you have attachment. That's something you're supposed to let go. Something that you're still attached to. Something that you think about quite often. It's time to let that go. Whatever your reoccurring thoughts have been, whatever thoughts that you cannot escape or that keeps you up at night, that always seem to creep back in. You need to handle up on that, baby. Handle up on that, okay? Also, um, I feel like if you don't, it will uh it will cause some type of lack because you're not letting that go. You're not letting that part of yourself go, or um because you're still so attached to it, it may throw you off course. Especially it could be financially, okay? And nobody wants that to happen. And, you know, if you're new to this and not true to this just yet, you'll quickly realize when it comes to, to spirituality and not handling up on business that you're uh, supposed to handle, there may be financial constraints, okay? Delays, detours, because you didn't want to listen to your intuition in the first place, okay? So, hmm. That was y'all spiritual progress support. Um, don't resist the change, okay? This was y'all's message. I am Jackson Knowledge Goddess. If you would like to donate to me in my channel, the uh, cash apps in the description box below. Thank you all. Bye.